Okay, YouTubers, this is The Angry Prepper. Thank you for joining me on The Angry Truth Channel. So, today's video, we're gonna talk about the CEO of YouTube winning the Freedom of Expression Awards. Now, a lot of you pop people probably don't give a fuck, but those of us YouTube creators do. Why? Because this fucking monkey, this lady here, this monkey sits here and wins a Freedom of Expression Award. Now, I know some people are like, well, freedom of expression is different from freedom of speech. Yes and no, right? Uh, Freedom of speech is freedom of expression. You're expressing yourself. You're expressing your ideologies, your opinions. That's freedom of speech. That goes into freedom of expression. How could the CEO of YouTube win the, the freedom of expression when YouTube actively deletes channels, demonetizes videos, deletes videos, puts you on a strike, gives you a warning, tells you that's bad, that's not good, they had natural remedy channels, guys, get kicked off of YouTube for talking about taking natural remedies to make yourself better. Not even involving COVID. Forget about that shit. Just, hey, how to alleviate a, how to alleviate a headache? Oh, how to alleviate high blood pressure? How to make your feet feel better? How to do this to your back? Take this, take that, right? Essential oils. Rub this here. Rub that there. They deleted those channels, right? They demonetized some of the videos. Medical misinformation. Medical information actually started because of COVID. So a lot of channels started taking a hit because of COVID, which I thought was interesting. So the lady's name, well, I showed you her name, but her name is Susan Wojcikic. I'm not even going to pretend that I give a fuck how to pronounce it. I don't. But YouTube has an insane censorship going on. We've seen this in the last few years. So this is not new. Though with COVID, they seem to want an overdrive because of medical misinformation. But... They've been starting this probably five years ago, maybe, maybe four or five years ago. And they started taking uh, Second Amendment channels off. They started taking uh, alternative medicine channels off. Homeopathic channels. Any channel that said otherwise, they were taking off. And listen, like I said, they were taking them off before COVID. But then when COVID hit, they were like, nope, you guys are not going to tell people how to make themselves feel better during COVID. Adios. Now, obviously, some channels get away with it. Some channels don't. I do find it weird that some channels that speak of the same shit are still on and other channels are completely off. So there's got to be something there. The other problem is when you leave AI in charge of these things, you run into problems like this. You run into problems of your free speech being impeded because you have a fucking computer telling you, oh, this guy said such and such and it was bad. Okay, let me interview it. And then you got some liberal fucking prick teenage kid sitting there going, I don't like, I don't like that. I do not like that he said COVID is just a flu to him. Delete, demonetize, strike. This is the world we live in. Guys, so when I talk about uh, these individual kids, some of the kids, they look at these videos and then they pass it through. Because again, some videos I, I've had that should have been demonetized were cleared. So it seems like there's somebody different each time looking at these videos going and they're using their emotions. So some kids who are not sensitive are passing videos through and other kids that are watching, uh, other sensitive kids watching the videos, they're fucking demonetizing videos. Some of my videos that were demonetized don't make sense. Some of them you could tell AI did it and they, they said it was manually reviewed. By who? If my video was manually reviewed by a human, they would not have demonetized a duct tape video. Right? A video I did on flat duct tape rolls, this one here. So that's on the Angry Prepper channel. So guys, again, why the fuck would they, you know, they, they, they sit there and give this lady the Freedom of Expression Award? She's a fraud. She's an absolute fraud. Her censorship is insane. So this is what this moron said during an interview. Now guys, keep in mind, she won the Freedom of Expression Award, which was given, which was run by YouTube or Google given to her. So it wasn't like she, you know, she went on an, an outside uh, company and they gave it to her. Google gave her this. But let me, let's go over what this idiot said. The freedoms we have, we really can't take for granted. We really have to make sure we're protecting them from, in every way possible. We have also, we also need to make sure there are limits. So she even admitted, guys, to there needs to be limits to what's being said. So then how do you win an award for freedom of expression if you just said there needs to be limits to what's said? Again, guys, these are the frauds of the world. These are the people of the world who are fraudulent but want to make themselves look like heroes, but they're not. 
a lot of content that technically meets the spirit of what we're trying to do, but it's borderline. And so for that, that content will be reduced, meaning we're just not going to recommend it to our users as much. Again, censorship. If it's borderline, we're going to cancel it. That's what she's saying there. All right, guys. Anyway, this was a short video on this bullshit and this asshole and her fucking, you know, pat on the back party. But other than that, this is the Angry Prepper. Thank you for joining me on the Angry Truths channel. You can like and subscribe to this channel. You can like and subscribe to the Angry Prepper channel. Thank you for watching.